hi everybody welcome back to my channel this is Teresa with let's talk I had to if you, it, I had to run into the Dollar Tree so I just wanted to show y'all what I bought it's just a small haul not even five minutes but I thought I'd share anyways if you're subscribed to my channel thank you if you're not hit subscribe comment share hit the notification bell so you know when I'm back on anyways let me do it it's only a few things it won't take no time at all one of the things that I've seen that I thought were super cute was this notepad. Look at this. See how pretty that is? It's a little uh, butterfly. And then on the front, it says, try me. Look at that. The butterfly lights up. How amazing is that? The butterfly lights up. <laughs> and you open the pad, it's just lined paper. You see? But I, and there's a butterfly in the back, but I thought the blinky dinky do light was amazing. I had to show y'all that. I had to grab that. I'm always grabbing notepads. I don't know why. I just really love them, but that's cute. And I got another pad, Traveler's Game Pad. It has tic-tac-toe, pig pen, telephone, scavenger hunt, hangman, everything all in this one pad. So when you're going on road trips with the kids or stocking stuffers or anything, and you could be going to the grocery store, let the kids sit in the back seat and play all these games. I thought that was really slick. I had never seen that, which is another reason why I wanted to show, to do this haul, because I can show you stuff that I haven't seen. So let me show you a few little things. This is the game Pig Pen. And I guess with this game... Two or more players take turns drawing a line between two adjacent dots. When a line creates a box, that player places his or her initials in the box. I guess there's a whole little method to that. So that's one of the games. That's pig pen. Let's see what else they got. You got your standard tic-tac-toe. That's really cool. And it has six sets of tic-tac-toe. You got Hangman. That's really good. It has the alphabet at the bottom. You know how on Hangman. Scavenger Hunt. This is when you're looking for the words and everything. This would be so much fun. I have never seen this, so I had to show you guys this. It was It's five great travel games to make the trip fly by. So anywhere you're going, I say you can use this with the, with the kids. I, I thought this was amazing. So if somebody else seen this and, they, and their kids are playing with it, let me know in the comments how they like it. I'm going to do a lot of these games. I love it. And, oh, another pad that I got. This one is a notepad with a gel pen. It's 100 sheets of paper. It's by Jot. It's 4.5 inches. Um, and it's got on the front good vibes. But the thing that I like, it's kind of Indian looking. And it comes with a pen. Good vibes. Look at that. I thought that was super cute. And you turn it around, it's blank. Let's take it out, out of the pack, and see what we got. Look at that pen attached to that. That is adorable. And this one is just like, uh, almost like a sketch pad. It's blank sheets. It's nothing on them. It's all blank sheets. So you just, you know... But you have the pen. You got good vibes. I think this is another great stock and stuffer or a gift. Not even a stock and stuffer. You can just give somebody who likes to write. Give them this kind of stuff. So that's super cute. Oh, check out this, what I found. It's a glass, and I picked it up for my husband because I just thought it was unique, so I got him too. Football glass, see? It's a glass. Look at the, these, are the, these are the little strings on the football. It's the front. It's the back. It's an 8-ounce glass shaped like a football. Come on. How cute is that? So I got them two of these, so I thought I would show that. That's why I said it's a small haul. It's just stuff I got for, that I would have picked up any, anyways, and I wanted to show you guys. They had these. This is a change purse. How cute is this? It says peace, and it has little snowflakes all over it. It's a mitten. It's a change purse. Look. It's a change purse. So you open it right here, and the change goes in there. Put your little nickels and dimes, and, and they had peace. They had love. They have, 
I believe they had, they got different colors. Some of them have um, mint candies on the front. I mean, you can give these in a stocking for anybody or just for yourself. I, I got this for me because I thought that was super, super cute. All right. Let's see what else we got. Oh, another, um, this is a game for kids ages six and up. Brain Busters card game. It's about nature. See? So I guess it has questions about nature. They had nature. They had um, sci-fi cards. They had um, like dinosaurs game. So it, the cards, I believe, just asks you questions and then somebody answers it. And, you know, and if you win, you win. If you don't, you keep trying, you know. But I thought that that was super cute. See, here's some of the cards. And they all got something different on the front. This one is like a volcano. This one is a cactus. This one is lightning. And then on the on the back, so here's one of the questions for a volcano. Maybe somebody can answer it. What do what do bees need for energy? Nectar or plant oils? See, that's the question. What do bees need? For energy nectar or plant oil if you know that answer put it in the comments because I don't know the answer to none of these but I thought it was really cool do male bees have stinger that's another one if you know the answer put it in the comments let's have a little game going here how many eyes do bees have does anybody know how many eyes do bees have so this one card has six questions and then the person asking the questions has the answers on the top I just thought, and it's all different ones like this, and I just thought that was cool. Look at this one. Polar bear. That is super cute. Really fun game, and it's educational, so it's going to teach your kids about nature, or sci-fi, or the other ones that they have. Um, gardening or something I think they had. Um, there's a bunch of them. You should really go to Dollar Tree and to your Dollar Tree and see if you can find it. Get all of them for your kids so they can learn in a fun way. I think there's five different kinds for a dollar each. You can teach your kids from home. I thought that was amazing. Oh, another thing I grabbed because I've been wanting it. Take it to go. Look at these cups. There's two cups, two for a dollar, you know. So it's like a coffee cup, hot chocolate, tea, whatever. I got this one. They have some really cute ones, but I got this one because it's two. And I, I just thought... Why get one when you can get two? <laughs> There's the inside. Here's the top. And you put your little coffee before you go to work or whatever. See? I love it. Take it to go. Two cups for a dollar. You got to go to your Dollar Tree and get this. If any of the stuff that I'm showing you guys, you running out to go get or you already have, let me know. Talk to me in the comments. Oh, this one is nothing, but it's a Swan nail polish remover. It's 100% acetone. I went in there for this. This is what I was going in there for. And let me tell you, a lot of the times I use the other name brand nail polish remover, and I have to keep scrubbing. I put a little bit on tissue, and it wiped my nails right off. They were done, and I took them all off today. Took no time. I think it's because it is 100% um, acetone, maximum strength. Easy to remove gel and glitter and no and nail polish. So it's six fluid ounces. It took that sucker right off. And then you have the ingredients and things in the back. But Swan is a good brand. They have this brand in the South a lot. Really good stuff. If you're going to do nail polish remover, use this one. It takes off gel. It takes off glitter. It takes off everything. Really, really easy. All right. Let me see what else I got. It's only a couple more things. So this one is enjoy seven days a week bagel chips roasted garlic i love bagel chips with cream cheese so when i see these, because i usually pay four dollars in the major grocery stores so i seen this is 3.17 ounces roasted garlic i thought why not give it a shot see bagel chips if you like bagel chips then i think this is the way to try it's total fat five grams it got all the nutritional facts on the side. But I figured dip this in some cream cheese, which is what I'm going to do with it. It's, it's worth a try. I'll let you know how that tastes. Bagel chips. 
And the last thing that I have, I told you it was a small haul and it was no big deal, is as seen on TV, Rapid Brand, world's fastest and easiest way to make brownies. Rapid Brownie Baker, make perfect brownies in the microwave in under four minutes. So I guess it comes with the brownie easy ingredient box and the pan. So it's four minutes in the microwave or 30 minutes in the oven. Dishwasher safe, reusable, and BPA free. Hmm, that's pretty cool. And I guess they have other things, but to find this in the Dollar Tree, I thought was great. Look how big the box is, you guys. That is really nice. And see on the back, it gives you the easy one, two, three, uh, one, two, three instructions on how to make it. Four minutes, over a half an hour in the oven. I, I think that's great. They got stuff on the side. And perfect for home, dorms, and offices on this side. And then you see on the top here, as seen on TV, I just thought that was pretty cool. I'll let you guys know how that tastes. But I thought somebody else might want to see that. That's a big box for a dollar. I should have got more. Why not? And I think that is all the stuff that I wanted to show you. I hope everybody's having a good day. I hope you hit subscribe and the bell so that you'll know when I'm coming on. Um, if you're, if you're new to my channel and you're starting off a channel, cause I'm new too. So if you're starting off a channel, I'll subscribe to you. You subscribe to me, however you want to do it. But I'm just glad that I was able to pop in, show you guys what I got. Hopefully you'll leave me a comment and say hi, or let me know if you're going to go buy any of this stuff. I just think it's pretty cool. Let me know. Talk to me in the comments. Anyways, have a good day. I'll talk to y'all later.